Hello and welcome to the JBNM Sports Fanatic channel. Thank you guys so much for joining me here on a Saturday, guys. And so, yeah, the Baltimore Ravens, they've activated running back Le'Veon Bell, defensive back Kevin um, Seymour, as well as offensive tackle Andre Smith from their practice squad. And they're also going to place defensive end Derek Wolf on IR. And so, obviously, we know what Le'Veon Bell, we know what he used to be down there in Pittsburgh. I mean, ever since they took him in the second round of the 2013 draft at six foot one, about 225, 230 pounds out of Michigan State throughout his career in 88 games. He's had 1,556 um, rushes for 6,400. 53 yards rushing, averaging 4.1 yards a carry and 40 touchdowns, but he doesn't stop there. He also has 394 career receptions for 3,259 yards and eight touchdowns, averages 8.3 yards a catch throughout his career. Now, obviously, they brought him on last year. He's with the Chiefs, didn't have a big role with the Chiefs, and ever since he held out for the Steelers and missed all of 2018 and he's came back, he has been that same guy. We understand that. The Ravens picked him up a little bit early on, added him to the practice squad because they knew that with all the running backs that they had, that went down through the injuries. They wanted to make sure they had enough depth at running back. I think they've done a tremendous job so far this season running the ball. But of course, that's a lot on Lamar on Lamar Jackson on Lamar Jackson's shoulder. So therefore, having a guy like Le'Veon Bell in the rotation, we'll see how that looks for them. But he can certainly help in terms of their pass catching and stuff out the backfield and just whatever experience he does provide there. So we'll see how they utilize him. But the Ravens, they got a current a lot of running backs that used to have big time names and stuff. Are either guys like Tavius Murray and stuff like that, you know, that's in that backfield already. So we'll see how he fits in with those guys moving forward forward you know and then when we're talking about Kevin Seymour we're talking about a guy that's six feet 185 pounds at that cornerback spot um, you know, and he, ever since Buffalo took him in the sixth round of the 2016 NFL draft and throughout his career, you know, we're looking at he suited up for 35 games throughout the course of his career. Um, he's even made five starts. He's got a total of 52 tackles um, along with seven pass deflections. You know, um, his last start came in Carolina in 2017 in which he started two starts for the Carolina Panthers that year as well. Um, so definitely going to be looking forward to seeing his contributions um, here with this team. There was a gap between 2017 when he was on an active roster for Carolina and then 2020 when he was on an active roster for the Philadelphia Eagles. But, yeah, certainly looking forward to seeing his contributions here for the Ravens. And then off to tackle Andre Smith. And so Andre, six foot seven, 335 pounds, 340 pounds, 34 years old, born in Birmingham, Alabama. For high school, he went to um, Huffman, Alabama, and when he was drafted by the Cincinnati Bengals in the first round of the 2009 NFL Draft, six overall. Throughout the course of his career, he has suited up for 118 games, and over the course of that time, he's also made 98 starts throughout his career. So certainly looking forward to the experience that you can bring having a guy like that activated off your practice squad. So certainly with these guys, I'm excited to see what the Ravens are going to do this week. They've got a tough match against the Denver Broncos. Should be a good one. Definitely let me know what you guys think about the move here, bringing these guys to the active roster spot from the practice squad and your expectations for the game on um, the Ravens versus the Broncos. Will Lamar Jackson and company be able to have their way versus that Broncos defense? Or will that Broncos defense that's looked pretty tough this year be able to have their way against the Ravens offense? Let me know your thoughts and make sure you press the thumbs up button as well as subscribe to the channel. I'm almost at a thousand subscribers. So each and every subscriber, you know, really matters on that journey on that goal of me reaching that 1,000 subscriber mark. So really appreciate you guys so much for all your support, your help, your comments, all of that stuff. So really appreciate you guys and look forward to seeing you guys next time.